I'm Ed Bender from Sinveo Anderson Lithograph, uh, Vice President, Director of Operations here for the company. Anderson Lithograph has been in business for roughly 60 years. We have 375 employees uh, in this one facility. Our, our niche in the in the printing segment would be in the high-end commercial printing, uh, automotive brochures, uh, high-end magazine and newspaper inserts. Um, as well as a, a large multitude of general commercial printing, but primarily our niche would be in the in the high-end commercial catalog, retail, uh, advertising type of business. My name is Charlie Lucas, so from Vale Anderson Lithograph. I'm the uh, web press room manager. Here at Anderson Lithograph, we have eight color capabilities, uh, single web, we have six webs, uh, five full webs, uh, UV coating on our eight color presses, six color with UV coating, uh, multiple fold configurations we're capable of doing, um, full gamut of things in that respect. When we first started looking for a replacement web press and we went to Mitsubishi to check out what the Diamond 16 press had to offer, we, we found that it had all of, the, all of the things we were looking for. Anderson came to the conclusion to go with a Mitsubishi press based on the flexibility of the press, uh, the fold capabilities of the press, uh, trying to utilize a shorter cutoff on this new press, which was uh, 22 and 3 quarters, and just some of the willingness from Mitsubishi to work with us on what our wishes were for folding uh, configuration. They had a double wide uh, combination folder that uh, that we capitalized on and, and that just fit exactly what we needed to, to produce in uh, folded products. Being able to put all of the different folds that this press and this folder were capable of doing made the the ROI relatively easy to achieve because of the speed we could get out of the press as well as the, the multiple of folds that we were able to get where in the past we were having to run that product into the sheeter and have to cut and fold it offline in the bindery. We are able to do that now on press as a press product. They worked with us in the, in the design and the layout stage in finding what was best for our configuration and uh, I think it was a win-win situation. Part of our requirements on, on uh selection of the Mitsubishi press was a willingness to work on the engineering of, we had a bay, a fixed bay that this press had to fit into and uh, overhead structure that uh, was a challenge and all the folding configuration that we wanted to accomplish so uh, that was a pleasure on Mitsubishi's half, behalf to uh, work with us on our constraints within the building. Anderson installed our first Mitsubishi at the end of January, beginning of February of 06. Um, right now it's in full operation and everything's going well. Our Diamond 16 Max is equipped with six uh, metal back printing units, mini gap. Uh, we have a double combo folder configuration with a uh, pinless former folder also. We went uh, to the metal back blankets on this knowing that it was somewhat of a pioneering standpoint for Mitsubishi and for ourselves. Um, but what we have found is the registration in not having the stretch that you'd normally have on a conventional blanket. We're finding that it's laying into the sheet a little bit nicer than the conventional blanket is. Um, dot gains have been predictable, uh, very stable. Register has been very good. We are getting upwards of uh, three times the lifespan on a metal back blanket that we do on a conventional blanket. Currently our run lengths vary a little bit uh, because of the make readies being, I think, more efficient that we're able to be more flexible on our run lengths, but the run lengths vary. Uh, they can be as little as, say, 60, 75,000 and as high as 8, 10 million. We run the press 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Our, our crews are uh, scheduled on eight-hour shifts. Uh, we work just about every weekend. With, uh, with putting as much work as possible on the Mitsubishi press. It's proven to be a workhorse uh, for us in being able to, uh, to produce uh, an optimum number of impressions per day, per week, per month that we've uh, been experiencing.
We bought this press with the full expectation to run it at the, the highest possible speeds we can. This press did not have the luxury of a, a honeymoon of easing into production. Uh, we went right at speed and it's performed well at speed. On our Mitsubishi Diamond 16 press, we'll, we've, we've been running anywhere from a 40 pound lightweight coated sheet to an eight point cover stock. Uh, it seems to handle anything we throw at it very well, from you know heavyweight coated book to, to lightweight coated book and, and cover stock. So it's done very well for us. The Mitsubishi Diamond 16 Max print quality is superior. We put we put the press through the rigors when we did our initial print tests with with solid and screen tests and streak tests and release tests to to make sure that it was going to meet our clients high demands and we've not put a job on it that it hasn't outperformed our expectations. Our customers have have embraced our new press with the the favorable pricing we're able to provide as well as the the folding and the product we're able to deliver. Um, it's been a, a well supported uh, press that we've put in and both by the sales staff and by our customers. Mitsubishi uh, print quality has been good. Uh, the metal back blanket uh, technology has proven to be a, a winner for us and stable dot gains and densities are very easily achieved. Done very well. We've been extremely satisfied with the, the throughput and the performance of the press at, at running at speed just like what Mitsubishi had, uh, had promised to begin with. In the service aspect of it, everything has been, uh, has been very good. To summarize our experience with Mitsubishi and our Mitsubishi Diamond 16 Max Press, um, in just a couple of words, um, I'd say fantastic. It's, it's done what we expected it to do and more.